right, you guys are ready for the recipe for the chili. Here are all the ingredients you're going to need. You're going to need some man, which is like my secret ingredient, some hunch crushed tomatoes. Brooks beans are the only beans that I use for my chili. You can use medium, mild, hot, whatever you choose, but I like to use mild and hot. Some rotel, which is some tomatoes as well. Some peppers. I use red, green, and I think it's yellow. Um, you need some garlic paste. You're going to need some Tony saturate, some onion powder, garlic powder, black pepper, lari seasoning. So I use ground beef. You need onions. And my other secret ingredient is Bob's spicy hot zesty sausage. And then you want to just start slicing up all your vegetables because it does take a long time. I, um, you know, use the different color bell peppers just to make it look good. You know, give it a little razzle dazzle. I use a lot of onions in mine. And I started thinking like, dang, I could just chop the onions and then use my little chopper thing for the rest of the stuff. So that's what I did. Now it's time to add all the flavors and the seasonings and everything together. First thing you want to do is saute your vegetables with butter. I use butter. Some people use oil or olive oil or stuff like that. I use a little butter. And um, I'm just going to season my vegetables with some pepper and chili powder. I didn't use any of the little packs. You know, you can use McCormick pack chili and all these other different chili packs and stuff like that. I just use chili powder and season it and it tastes really really good okay so after i saute my vegetables all up my plan was to just use one pot and it's very easy just transfer everything that's cooked into a bowl and clean as you go for you can have a clean kitchen that's one of the things people don't talk about when they're cooking is cleaning in order to be able to cook you need to clean as you go okay be cooking in chaos is crazy to me like i don't know how to do that so i try to clean as i go so it won't be dirty stuff everywhere and I try to use as minimal amount of dishes as possible. Okay, see my vegetables are all sauteed and I'm about to just move them into a little bowl I got off to the side and then start on the next thing that is going to be in my chili, which is going to be the Bob Evans pork sausage zesty hot okay it's like a little secret ingredient i don't know if people use sausage in a um chili but i do and it's really really good okay try it don't knock it until you try it this is why you try new recipes okay it's something you ain't familiar with that don't mean it's nasty that mean you just not familiar with it so give it a try it's really good i like it so i grind that up and with my little chopper and then cook that real real quick making sure it's done i don't cook my sausage and my beef together because i feel like pork and beef don't go together cooked so you cook it separately and then you mix it together it's better to me i know it's crazy all right i put that off in the pot i mean the bowl over to the side <coughs> oh i'm back that cough tried to take me out of here y'all i don't know my allergies is messing up with me but I'm back, I'm back. So what we're gonna do now is chop up that beef a little bit and let that cook off camera. I just let it cook regular and then I put in the same thing which is the um chili powder and some pepper and then we just poured in the man which was really really good. It's a secret ingredient and the rotel dip. I put that in there. Not the dip, but the rotel, the can it the, the rotel is the can, okay? And then right here I'm putting in the pork sausage with the garlic paste. I squoze up on top of it and then all of the little vegetables and stuff like that that's going all in there now me i like my chili to be a little thick a little hearty a lot of people don't they like it to be more of a soup so they make more of a broth and all you have to do with that is add more of the crushed tomatoes or more you know whatever you use to make it saucy you can just season it a lot 
put a lot more seasoning and add more water if you want to but i just like mine a little thick a little hearty but it's up to you i even see some people add beef broth to their chili to stretch it and make it like a soup but i don't you know when i want mine to be a little soupy i just add a little more water and a little more chili powder and a little more crushed peppers just you know it's up to you up to your description but season that thing real real good um another thing that i do add to my chili because i'm about to get off of here and just play some music is um a little sugar because of all of the tomatoes being added all of that acid being in the chili from the tomatoes and all that it cuts it and it's not as acidy i get acid reflex and i it'd be hard for me sometimes when i eat anything with tomatoes in it tomato paste tomato sauce anything like that spaghetti meat um, meatloaf if it's with a red sauce anything with bread sauces basically is it mess with me a little so i add a little sugar cut it it'd be good you don't taste sweet none of that it's just a little different okay i love y'all after this portion is shown i'm gonna make some um chili logs i'm gonna show y'all how i made that that was really easy i got that recipe from um a lady off of instagram all things rachel so shout out to her and i hope y'all enjoy happy vlogtober day eight or nine because i'm putting two videos out on one of these days because i missed one but i love y'all and thank y'all for watching leave some comments down below and i'm working on some more footage very very soon thank y'all for being you period Oh.
West Coast Pimp. Say what? Dirty South. Uh, Here we go. Can y'all really feel? Baby girl. East Coast Pimp. Uh huh. West Coast Pimp. Can you feel us? Dirty South. Dirty, dirty. Can y'all really feel? Feel us. East Coast Pimp. Say what? West Coast Pimp. Uh huh. Dirty South. Dirty, dirty, dirty. Can y'all really feel? I got my hip back. East Coast Pimp. Uh huh. West Coast Pimp. Whoop boy. I've been watching you like the hawk in the sky. That God bring you on my prey. Boy, I promise you, if we keep bumping heads, I know that one of these days we gon' hook it up, probably talk on the phone. But she, I don't know if that's good. I've been holding back this secret from me. I probably shouldn't tell it, but if I let you know. What am I? 
my golden tooth Said I've been needing you, needing you Wondering if you're the same Then who's been with you? Makes your heart so fine I wanna cry sometimes I miss you All to college Miss you in a way Straight from high school You up and left me We were close friends Also lovers did everything for one another Now you're gone and I'm lost without your feet now But I know I gotta live and make it somehow Come back to me Feel me calling Calling for you Cause About you and the days we used to share, it's driving me crazy. I don't know what to do. I'm just wondering if you still care. Don't oh, let you know that it's killing me. I know you got another life, you gotta concentrate, baby. Come back to me. To me. Can you feel me calling? This was so easy and simple to make. The only thing is when you got to film it, it takes so much longer than what it's supposed to. I had to reheat my cheese like three times. Um, I was filming it for y'all and for TikTok. And it's only because I did the um, TikTok of the chili too. So it's just to give another idea, a little fall snack, you know, tailgate idea, anything like that. Just trying to be on my grind and keep content coming on all platforms so i'm about to film this real quick and call it a night i'll see y'all in vlog miss not vlog miss see i'm starting already i'll see y'all in vlogtober day six seven i don't know what day but i might be right see y'all later Bye. <laughs> She brought a buddy in, what you studying? Education, that's where the money is. You think you're funny, huh? Yeah, I'm the funniest. So what about you? A friend replied, I don't go to school. Okay, what you do? I'm a dancer. Quick question, are you a dancer? I said, hell nah. Where you pants at? She said blue flame. They should be jam packed. I said, damn facts. So where y'all mans at? They said, what's that? Smiled at each other and they both laughed. I don't need a man, she my other half. We got something not a lot of others have. And I feel like I know it from the past. I mean, at this point, we're like lesbians. Then they had another laugh. That's it. Give me with a F and blue girls with him. Told me he ain't got a preference. Got them both down and I asked a few questions. At last week and ain't already best friends. Already best friends. At last week and ain't already best friends. Friend. Last week and ain't already